Good afternoon, everybody. Matt M. Roy here. Today, I want to talk about my newest acquisition, which is this right here. My new Power Mac G4 400 megahertz power PC. Now, I picked this up over the weekend at a yard sale for $10. Yes, believe it or not, for $10. Um, it did have some issues when I picked it up. Apparently, somebody had tried to put in a 120 gigabyte Western Digital hard drive and had actually installed it incorrectly. Uh, I do plan on doing some upgrades to this system in the near future. So far, I have upgraded the original 256 megabytes of RAM to 640 megabytes, and I also installed that hard drive properly. Now, let me do a boot up for you. And you will not hear the Mac bong because I do not have my speakers turned on at the moment. Now I have installed OS 10.4.11 Tiger, which is the latest version that a 400 megahertz power PC can run. I have heard on the internet that some people have gotten Leopard to run on 450 megahertz or faster power PCs, but I have tried it and it just runs so slow you wouldn't even want to use the system. Okay, and here's the desktop about this Mac as you can see 400 mega power PC G4 with 640 megabytes of SD RAM this is the single core system no dual processor in this uh, in this Apple and as you can see I've got about 119 gigabytes free and I've just installed the basics on here, running Safari, got Firefox, VLC Media Player, which I would highly recommend to anybody out there who likes to play oddly formatted video and audios. It will play almost anything that you download online. Latest version of iTunes, VI Calculator, Luxor. Uh, QuickTime, Microsoft Office 2004. I only keep the word on the deck because that's about the only program I use. Got GarageBand, iPhoto, and iMovie. This is a very good computer and it's a lot quicker than I thought it would be. Uh, of course the 640 megabytes of memory do help. It was very slow with only the 256 megabytes. Um, I will be doing some more videos about this system in the future. I do intend to upgrade the DVD-ROM drive to a DVD burner. Um, I haven't decided if I want to go with uh, an Apple Super Drive uh, branded, or I might just go with a Pioneer. Um, you can pick any Pioneer DVD burner up at Best Buy for about $30 and they will work in this system but uh, because they're not exactly tuned the, with the firmware you do get some issues occasionally well everybody this is again my power mac g4 and look forward to seeing more videos about this system